You're blowing shofars. How y'all doing? I gotta document this. So I was, I'm on my way to Albuquerque. The motorcycle has a little problem. I've got to reattach the muffler. Uh, the exhaust pipe came out, um, it, it rolled over. Anyway, so I had to take a trip to uh, Albuquerque and I asked Siri to find a, a Triumph shop and which is probably impossible. And it brought up Royal Enfield Triumph. I mean, that's crazy. Royal Enfield Triumph. If you're me and you went to Chanati with a Royal Enfield and the Lord showed you we are the Royal Enfield and we left and went out and then he had me trade that in and get a Triumph to go to Kill Devil Hills. Now, oddly enough, when I pulled over here to get what I need, right behind me there is what the... Uh, the mind-blowing thing you just saw was so what are the odds probably like one in a trillion so i pulled up in this parking lot and i opened my and i've been praying saying lord please encourage me i need encouragement i mean i left on this trip here the shofars are right here look see that blue bag those are two shofars I was like, Lord, please encourage me that I'm doing what you wanted me to do. And I walked out of my car right here to go into that hardware store. And there are all these people blowing shofars. I was like, what in the world? They're standing in the parking lot blowing shofars all northeast, south, and west. <laughs> you can't even think that up. And my prayer was, Lord, would you please encourage me so I know that I'm on this road trip doing what you want me to do. You told me to bring the shofars. Here they are. There the shofars are right there in my car in my front seat. Guys, have you ever pulled up and seen anyone blowing a shofar anywhere ever in your life? Ever? Ever. <laughs> okay. Here we go.